Hello there guys, and today we've got our episode of my FIFA 13 career mode with PSG. So, in this first game we're going to Everton and we come away with a 3-1 win. Then in the next game we're going to Liverpool and we come away with a 6-0 win. So if you want to sit and skip ahead to that or just want to wait and watch, then by all means do. And so, what we're going to talk about today is just a little bit about the game, then a little bit about two topics and so on and so forth. So... The, the gameplay obviously is just me playing. The first two games were probably the best games, and then the, sec the last two were okay. And um, I've actually started to actually enjoy playing with Ibra now. Ibrahimovic, he's actually alright to play with, and I'm really enjoying it. And he's been scored a lot of goals, so I am actually liking it. And so is Muriel. Um, I am really enjoying those two up front as well. And so somebody told me to sign. Alexandro Pato, so maybe if I do sell Ibra um, sometime soon, because he is getting on a bit, and so if I do want you know, as much money out of him as I can, I might as well sell him soon, but we'll see how that goes. So if I did have to sell him, I'd probably get Pato, because he does have 89 pace, and he does have good um, shooting, and he's 5 star skills, and he's only 23 years of age, so he's overall World Cup a lot, so he's definitely one to look out for, so thank you for recommending him. So, um, well, today I'm recording this, a lot of people have said that the world will end tomorrow. Well, it's the 20th today, and in Australia it's the 21st. And um, they'll say that it's the, um, the world's going to end on the 21st. How will it end? You know, um, they've said the world, like I've been asked before, all this sort of happened, has anyone ever said in the past, um, well, this is to my grandma actually, this is a couple of years ago, about, I won't say a couple actually, about a year ago or earlier this year, has everyone actually ever said the world's going to end? And, you know, there's loads of times people have said the world's going to end. It's not going to end. The amount of things this world's gone through, volcanoes, earthquakes, tsunamis, all that sort of stuff, it's not going to end. And the amount of time it's been living from, you know, I think it's 14 billion years or whatever, something like that, something ridiculous like that, do you think it's going to end just like that? It's not, and so... You know, it's not going to be our, what we've done on the Earth's not going to end it, is it, really? Because we're just like a little, you know, little, little like stick figure compared to the Earth. So, hardly think we're going to do much damage to it. So, you know, there's a big sun that's, you know, amazing, loads of heat over there. Do you only think that would have burned, you know, away this long? I don't know. That's just weird. I shouldn't have said about the sun. But anyway, uh, we do get a penalty there, which is um, really good. And to see Muriel take it, I would have thought Ibra would have been up because it's the better stats. But I guess not. We'll uh, let Muriel take that. So, like I'm saying, the world ain't gonna end. Uh, in my eyes, just a little bollocks. It's not gonna happen. So, if you are worrying, then um, I'd save yourself it because it's not worth the amount of time you're wasting. So, yeah. And also, um, lately I've been staying up to like three o'clock in the morning. So, I might have said it into the last commentary. If I did, then I'm sorry. But like I say, I've been staying up to about three a.m. Going to sleep, then waking up at the next day, like wasting a lot of hours the next day, and then doing the same every night. So I need to stop doing that. And so today I actually got up at a twelve instead of um, three o'clock, like I did the first time, did it? Um, so hopefully tonight I go to bed at a uh, a reasonable time, like maybe twelve o'clock or something, so I get up at a decent time tomorrow. So um, what I've been doing at those late hours actually is the reason why I did um, stay awake till like four a.m. is the fact that. Um, I don't know if you know Raider Games, um, like I say, I've probably mentioned them before too many times, I don't know, but you put the in-betweeners, and so I just watched it ever since, and um, I'm pretty addicted to the movie, um, the in-betweeners movie, which was brought out last year, actually, and I've never actually seen it, which is, you could say, is a really big surprise, considering it's over a year old, and um, I only just watched it, like, yesterday, and... I've been proper like addicted to it ever since and I've just been watching it more or less like every night and all the other episodes of it so I've been watching that so like I say that's what's been coming up to the late hours and what I've been watching all these days and that goal there by Ad Ryan is amazing and seeing that though he's an earlier um, I think he's only 73 overall I'm not too sure but he can score them goals it's absolutely amazing and some 80 overalls can't even score them type of goals so I am happy for that to buy him so, I think you saw before that it just did say, they pop up saying, um, Renzi's choice is paid off, and they actually have all these, um, buys that I've bought, all these players that I've bought are actually paid off, and played really good, so as you can see there, the goalkeeper gets, um, what's it called, man in a match, which, like I was saying, I don't really want to keep him, which I don't, so hopefully I will, you know, get rid of him sometime soon, and obviously bring newer in to replace him, so... 
Um, Thiago Silva is still injured. You could you could play him, but I'd, I'd rather not. I'd rather him just fully recover, then play him so he doesn't get injured again, even for longer. And so, you know, that's why I sort of want to wait out. So, like I say, guys, um, I've been watching um, the Retrainers, doing all that sort of stuff, like I say. So, hopefully, I get my sleeping, path, sleeping pattern sorry, back to normal and up and, you know, so I can wake up at normal hours again. And so, yeah. And uh, these videos, I know, um, hopefully you guys want to watch, uh, want to see these daily. I'll try to bring them out every day. It's just hard to, um, like I say, I'll record them. And then I'll go out, you know, watch uh, some episodes in between us or something like that. Or, you know, just watch some stuff on YouTube. And then I'll do that. And then I'll wait till the last minute, which is like 5 o'clock now. And I'm supposed to be uploading it around 6, 7 o'clock. So, you know, I'll leave it till sort of last minute to edit it. And I don't... I just don't feel in the mood to edit it, so you know I really should edit them early on or edit them in advance, something like that. And you see there, Lucas, long shot from outside the box, which you can't really see a long shot, but I say it's all right. And so he's actually improving now; he's got up to an 83, which is really good. You see Ibrahimovic there with a goal. Like I say, I'm really enjoying him now, and I'm really um, starting to understand how to play him. Like he's more of the guy that you know. Um, blasting the goals from the outside of the box and then also headers them in and then Muriel will be the guy who sprints up the pitch past all the players and will score so sort of trying to get used to that and see how that goes and so yeah and so guys if you do have any movies or just films films is probably a better word to say uh, films that you reckon are good to watch like I say um, definitely leave them in the comments below because it'd be fun to watch like I say over the past couple of days, I've been watching a lot of new stuff like, um, like In Between Us, Hotel Hell, Idiot Abroad. Like even though I watched that like a long, long time ago, um, the first and second series. Like I say, I still watch them sort of videos, uh, films. Sorry, I would say the films. I don't know what series, whatever you know. Um, any of that sort of stuff. Do leave them um, in the comment section below, and I'll happily sit watch that because it's sometimes good to watch a new film and discover you know it's actually good and I enjoy it. So. Well, my nose again. Like I say, this nose is really good to annoy me, but we'll have to uh, move along. Like I say, guys, um, thank you for all the support on these three episodes, and hopefully you will continue them, and hopefully I will continue uploading them for you guys to watch. And so thank you guys for watching, and hope you have a good day.